Hello everyone and welcome to Techno Babylon. I'm really stoked to start the series because this game is overwhelmingly positive on Steam. And you know what that means? As a classic cyberpunk game, this game is just gonna be so great. And I'm so excited to play it for the first time with you guys today. Join me with the series and let's dive in. This is Techno Babylon. Looks like you found the place. You're sure this is the one? I'm positive. Lantha Sesame, there's my mandala in the trance. There's a big gap in the records, and it's shaped exactly like her. I thought you said he put a lot of effort into it. They've been hiding her activity, but weren't covering up their own work very well. If they did, then I... Ah! Headaches? How are the headaches? Won't be a problem for much longer. You understand the plan? Mysterious. Don't I know exactly what I'm doing. All right, dude, let's see what exactly you are up to. After all, I've been planning this for years. For years. Techno Babylon. Prisoner of Consciousness. There's nothing like being in trance. A world built of abstracts and intellect, of tangible thought, where every part has been crafted by an individual soul. It's the purest form of contact a person can have, mind to mind. It's the pinnacle of human achievement. Some might say that achievement in the physical world is somehow more meaningful. To them I say, join the future or be surpassed by it. Within the trance, oh. we are millions of minds as one. But even as far as we've come, there's still one serious flaw. It's reliance on the real world as its backbone. Oh, so we've got to like eat and stuff. Can't be in VR forever. In disconnections. Damn. Don't panic. I'll just go and speak to the building manager. It's not like there's anything to be afraid about there. Is that foreshadowing? Let's get this over with. I'm a little afraid now. I wasn't afraid before, but now that you've said it, I think I'm extra afraid. So move your mouse over here. Select trance to disconnect. This being trance. Disconnect. Better go and talk to the building manager. Better go and do that. Ah! Oh, t ouch. My lady. Yeah, the door is closed. Huh? Oh, I'm assuming it's always automatic, right? So she would never actually have to open Password. her own door. Huh? I guess the door's broken too. Contact Something's fishy is going on. Contact manager. Unable to connect. Can't call. No internet. What is going on? Trapped? For the first time you can remember, the prospect of staying inside your apartment is frightening to you. We're trapped. So left click to interact and right click to look at. Um, here we have a pile of clothes. It's full of blue overalls, a kind provided by the city to the unemployed. Made out of a cotton paper blend. They are mulched and recycled into new clothing rather than rather than cleaned. The large drain on the floor means that cleaning the room can involve as little as hosing everything down. Cheap is the way it's done in here. Nasty. Ugh, exposed fiber optics everywhere. I think they deliberately do this to make it less pleasant to live here. Could be. The Net Games trophy I won in 84. I don't know why I've still got it. I pretty much scrapped everything else to build the wetware still. Nice, so you are a champion indeed. Um, what's this drippy? I'm not sure when I got this out of the machine. It's still soggy, though. Gross. I'm not sure when- Ew, is this supposed to be food? The gaping black chute dominating the food machine's top half is where trays and cutlery are deposited for recycling. The materials are melted down and vacuum formed into new utensils every time you order a meal. Some places use metal utensils, but down here in the poor blocks, it's all just plastic. Let's check it out. Can a protein shake? A nutrient plot complex? Let's get a protein surprise. A food tray pops from the machine serving slot completely empty. The pipes must be blocked hey, again. Hey, I'm hungry. <laughs> I am hungry. Um, okay. Let's look into the shower. There's something in the shower and it looks so nasty. 
You remove the gelatinous clump of semi-organic wetware you've been cultivating in the still. It looks like it's grown enough to be usable by now. So we picked up some wetware. I'm assuming wetware is like different from hardware that it's like, like wick liquidy, like a liquid machine. It's organic. I don't know, like a living creature. Okay, the technology is beyond me, but that is the wetware still. The still is empty. It'll take at least a few hours to grow another batch of wetware. So she grows that stuff her on her own. Okay, that's kind of cool. That's neat. Let's take a look at our things. Should we take the fork? Mm, nah, I'm not that hungry. No. Can we use the fork on the door panel? Hmm, huh. it broke. So we broke our fork on the door panel. Okay, the flimsy plastic that the fork was made of wasn't up to the task. Um, can the tray do it? The plastic tray won't help you get inside the panel. Fine. This thing. Establishing connection. Connection complete. The department's centralized system speaks to you more clearly than ever as your wetware joins with its systems. Wait, that means I can communicate with the door? Oh, we picked up a trophy. I wonder what we can use for that. I guess I could take the tray and recycle it. Can I recycle the trophy? The machine thinks for a moment that displays a message. Error. User safety settings enabled. Unable to produce metal utensils due to danger of harm. To change this, please seek administrator. Uh, permission. Thank you for your cooperation. Your future on a plate. Hey, Thank you. we're not children. Lousy suicide rate. Aw, oh, dang it. So we still have a trophy. Can we put the trophy inside the still I and make- I don't think it needs a small tin pot. Oh, it's a pot. The trophy's a pot. Okay, um, can I clean up this I mess? I don't think it needs a small tin pot. No, it does not. Okay, so I have wetware. Can I put the, the wetware in the still? The colony of wetware nope. already in the still will start to grow soon. It doesn't need any help. Ooh, our wetware can establish a connection with the food thing or the recycling thing. You feel a flow of new data as your wetware in angles itself, inveigles itself into the food machine system. Reaching your arms to the recycling slot can only end in tears. Can we still print or we don't get, we don't get any. Food tray, completely hey, empty. I'm hungry. Aw, oh, dang it. So there's nothing new from that one. It won't come out, must be locked in place. Oh, you can eject it. Sweet, I picked up a memory module. Should I just put it back? Cause now we don't have a menu. Whoopsies. Here you can have it back. All right. I think if we go here, we can, oh, we can go back to our trance. And here we are. Yes, here's the connection to the food machine and to the door panel, thanks to our wetware. So I'm assuming the wetware is connected to the grid of Hi, I'm Sheffy, your interactive VR. guide to THB foods oh, on oatmeal sweets. Why can't I put metal in the recycler? Why can't I put metal in the recycler? It might be dangerous! At the request of Newton Civic Housing Services, you've been limited to plastic utensils. But isn't plastic great? It's so easy to get clean. But what if I want something stronger, like steel? That heavy protein mash bends the fork sometimes. Sorry, uh -uh, no can do. I'm not just a chef. It's my job to keep you safe. How do I show you off? How would I stop you stopping me? I need a fork. Why would you want to do that? Don't you like me? My lady. I just want to make sure you're eating right. So you object to me smashing you open? It takes some pretty serious damage to do that. I'm tough. Only qualified THB systems technicians can get me open. Looks like messing with your software is my best bet then. All right. Will the will machine, the machine work, work without, without you? you? Because I've had an accident. The machine will continue to dispense. We don't want you starving in an emergency now, do we? <gasps> oh, okay. 
You annoy me. You're really, really annoying. You know that? Address all concerns regarding T H E. Avatar two eight six two. Shappy two T H E. Customer interaction. T H E. I love it. Okay, goodbye. Bye. Oh dear goodness. Yeah, we're not gonna. Have to, let's not talk to her. Let's see if we can get the door open this way. Forsooth, who would summon the guardian of thine abode? Uh, this eye. Can you give me a metal fork, please? Um, what What's do you your do? Function? I am the defender. I prevent intrusions upon thy fortress. Oh. The physical nice. and the etheric. Mm. I found you in the door's terminal software. You're the apartment's network security, aren't you? Quite so. Trojans and malware flee from my presence. I bet they do, but sir. You also control the door's security. A vital role, milady. None shall threaten the sanctity of your domain. So, who are you? Who are you? I am the defender, the guardian, the knight. The knight. No threat shall dare intrude upon thy domain while I stand watch. Do you have a name? I do not wish to trouble my lady with such minute details. So, just knight then. Whatever thy will, milady. Cool. Can you get me out? The door seems to be stuck. Can you do anything about that? Attempting to operate door drive systems. Attempt two. <gasps> attempt three. It would appear the machinery of the door itself has become fatigued. The terminus is unable to compel activity on the door's part itself. The safety unlock would doubtless serve you well at this juncture. Can you use the safety unlock? I'm afraid I cannot. It must be unlatched physically. Oh! So where is it? It lies behind the terminal. With sufficient armament, mayhaps thou shalt reach it. Gee, thanks. Okay, so... Ciao. I'm gonna go Fairly back to well, that room there. Thanks. You were giving me a big hint here because if I go back, I need to find a way to get the food machine open. Um, can I use this thing on it? Can I smash it open? Okay, I have memory now, but that doesn't help me with anything. And let's take a look at the news. No connection. Okay, that's fine. Um, sports. Weather. Dang it. Okay. So let's go to the mailbox. Newton supports. Hey, Mrs. Sesame. This message reminds you that you have not been attending your scheduled employment meetings. If you do not inform us of our Instances, you risk losing housing support from the city. You're, you have been receiving city support benefit for 711 days. And we hope that you will be able to improve your circumstances soon. That's rough. I'm sorry. Uh, dear, my name is Marcus. I am chief financier. Oh, God. This is totally a scam. Um, cool. Hey, Tola. Seems like we haven't seen you in... We haven't seen you in years. No idea if you heard, but there's a big game coming up at the Rotunda. If you're up for leaving your apartment, we can probably get you a place on the team. Oh, so she does have opportunities, but she chooses to stay jobless, I think. Maybe? Is that what this is? I would say she's pretty talented, so I wonder why she's in this situation. X's Pharma received. Do you want the extra interface beady without... Oh my god, without the extra cost. Speed with extra farm one. Open attachment for order info. Oh god. Attachment. Downloading package. But it sounds sus. It looks sus. It looks like it can definitely hack me, so let's not. Yo, Dola. Dala, good hearing from you. Though I know really it means you want something. Basically, yes, the batch of blue wetware you got is cracked, so you can grow it yourself. Just don't gray goo your place. It needs a few things. Water, since it's made 90% of water. Nutrition, it's an organism after all. Heat, it's a normal, it's the normal stuff it'll cause to break down, but this blood is activated and stuff. Stuff. Oh, okay, cool, cool. Good to know. Refresh inbox. I have no connection. I don't know why I even tried. So cool. Let's exit out of that. Um, can I? Uh, no, I'm not storing that in my brain. Not unless I want to wake up in some factory in China in 10 years. Oh, okay. 
connection. Can she read Hi, it? Hi, I'm Shappy, your interactive. <gasps> Actually. Ciao. Bye. Oh my God, I know what I, I know what to do. The memory card. <gasps> Copied. Uh, I got. I got it. The memory card is ready to go. Now we just gotta go back to the real world and put that into the machine and get rid of Sheffy somehow. She just has to read it. Oh my God, let's, perfect, let's throw that in there. And let's head back to the trance and let's talk to Sheffy. Hi, I'm Sheffy, your interactive guide to THB Foods Auto Meal Sweets. Okay, so what's on your recipe card, your now? Recipe card now? I see there's some new recipe data. It looks like... Apparently whatever virus was writing that t-mail is doing some damage. You don't look so good. Sounds more like you need someone to put you out of your misery. Oh my gosh. How would I stop you stopping me? I need a fork. Uh, yeah? How about I stop you stopping me stopping you? Then I guess I'd have to stop you stopping me stopping you stopping me? <laughs> oh my gosh, she's all messed up. You, you don't, don't look good. Look so good. I went to That's nice. What about your- I was you! Yes? That's terrifying. Why can't I put metal in the recycler? Not while I'm a boss. <laughs> Chevy, you're freaking Ciao. terrifying. Okay, so it hasn't completely broke her. I wonder if the door guy will help us. Because he's security, right? Forsooth, who would summon the guardian of thine abode? Um, yeah, Sheffy's sick. I think Sheffy the chef's come down with something. The steward harbors a blight? Zounds! This shall not be allowed to continue! Oh my god, oh, thank you! Hi, I'm a there are grave accusations of treason upon your head, steward! Stand and face me! We shall see what trial by combat makes of you! I'm sorry, I don't praise! How about thee? Well, that takes care of her. Oh my goodness, let's go back and now let's throw our trophy into the machine. Because now we can. All right, now let's... Um... After a few moments of the mechanical protest, the machine eventually gives in. Yes, and give me fork. Metal tray and a metal fork. Oh my god. Can I use a metal tray on I the can't vent? Use it like nope. I can't use it. <laughs> Let's use the fork on here. Got it. That's right, we got it. Yes, we made it. This guy again. All right. Um, there was an explosion. And he walked away. I feel like somehow he's slightly responsible for that one. All right, Suicide City. 20 hours earlier. This is it. Animus Organics. Animus Organics. Right on this one? I still don't think an AI, however powerful, could predict a crime like this. However, if it does help us catch the Mindjacker. Central hasn't exactly been generous with the details. I don't really think we're going to find anything here. There are other, stronger leads we ought to be chasing. Car. Cell cruiser. Elevator. Hey, anyone there? 
Doesn't look like anyone's around. While you technically have the authority to command or ca commandeer vehicles for cell business, Central would need a very good reason to override the car system. Okay, so we can do a lot of things. Hey, hey, service. Animus must be one of those places that doesn't keep staff working nights. Very strange. Mm-hmm. It's literally empty. Can they just go to the elevators? And help ourselves? The elevator's locked. Panel says authorized personnel only. I guess we need to find someone who counts as authorized then. Okay. We're not authorized. I have a jolt gun and a traveler. What's a traveler? Contacts. Oh, it's this is my phone. Good thing what we were inside. The hell? That actually scared me. That was terrifying. Let's investigate the body. What'd you find? A I got a key card. card. This man was custodial staff, a janitor. Probably not our mindjacker's target then. Still, I don't think this was an accident. We need to find out what's going on here. That was sus. Okay, thanks for the key card though, I guess. Oh, I forgot to do the key card this way. Like a true gamer. It's unlocked floor 26 for us. Must be where its owner was working. Are we not going to talk more about that? Are we just going to actually just going to go straight into the fire? We don't know what's up there. Oh, dear. Oh. <sighs> that would do it. Oh, no. Damn it all. Burns all around the planar nodes in his wetware wiring. Yeah, this is our mindjacking victim. Central was right. The attack was recent, maybe minutes ago. The mindjacker was probably interrupted by the janitor who ended up on the street. There's only one other way out of here, to the roof. We need to get up there before he escapes again. Um. His ID badge says Gerbach, Avery. He's an HR supervisor. Take his t if the his key card. in corporate espionage, it's a pretty strange target. Have Central run his data. See if it can flag anything. Okay, let's see the telephone. Oh, there's a lot. So, Arctis Dorset. Artwood Roy. Close Manson. Arona Diener. Gallet Pat. Matt Solf. Felipe the News. Hello, this is Philippe. I am away on assignment at the moment for one month. If you wish to leave me a message, you can do so after the beep. Or if you have a story, please contact the news desk directly. I don't know why I called that guy. Um, should we just go down the list and just call each one? Hello? Is this David? Listen, man. I know I have some explaining to do. Sorry. Wrong number. Oh, yeah, what was that? How many wrong numbers are we gonna hit? Apparently all of them? I think I found the office manager's contact. See if he'll help us. Remember, be consistent when you're talking to him. Consistent. Uh, what? Who the fuck are you? I have any idea what time it is. Mr. Ratwood, my name is Dr. Regis. I'm an investigator for Cell. Uh, uh, what? I mean, <clears throat> what's happened? <sighs> I just need to ask a couple of questions. There's some trouble at your office. It's an emergency. I just need to ask you a couple of questions about your workplace. Oh, Nuke. You're calling from the office. What's happened? We need your- you're not in Don't trouble. Don't worry, you're not in trouble. We need access to the roof stairwell in your office. Wait. How do I know you're really a cell agent? I can't just give out the code to anyone. None of this will come back to on you. You have nothing to worry about. You're perfectly safe. We just need your help. I'm transmitting my credentials to your terminal. So you're really a cell agent? Yes. I guess I can't say no then. The roof access code is 6167. Thanks. Other cell agents may contact you later for more information. Cool. Um, so we found that person. Can I call the last person? <laughs> uh, hello? Do you know what time it is?
that is. Sorry, wrong number. All right, so um, this is a terminal. Oh, I guess I could have just used the computer to figure out who I needed to call. It's time and place for the trance and it's not up on the roof. Yes, it's private, but it's extremely dangerous. Management asks to keep the roof access locked unless it's an emergency for your information. Trance cravings do not count as emergencies. Seriously, Avery, you're great at your job, but you need to keep it. Animus, that was at, um, at with the person we just talked to. Animus CR. Um, publicity management to Avery. Please be aware that Tomorrow's midday UV exposure index is expected to peak at eight. Your genetic background indicates a propensity to melanoma. Please take extra care in order to maintain long-term health. Um, hey man, I just wanted to say big grats on the engagement. She's a really swell girl and I know you guys are going to be so happy and now he's dead. That is so sad. Sorry, my dude. Let's go to the door. So the code is 6167. Ta-da! We have access granted. Can we go through the door Come now? Come on, we've almost caught up with him. I did take my sweet time. I think we might have lost him. Oh, this is our dude. Sir. The mind jacker. Freeze. Cell He's agents. the mind jacker. Drop Lay your, down weapon. your weapon and put your hands above your head. Does that ever work? Sometimes. It was worth a try. Um, you're there's the no only escape. way off this rooftop is down, either with us or over the edge. Frankly, the second one's fine by me. Oh gosh. What? Oh, his jetpack. Villain vibes. I hate it when that happens. What? He had lifting gear. He's escaping by aerostat. Central, our mindjacking suspect has fled the scene by air. Interceptors dispatched. Belcourt officers have arrived on scene at Animus. Please return to headquarters for debriefing. Nuke it. We were so close. Nuke it. Who would have thought? He pulled a fast one for sure. He jumped off the edge and we're like, oh no. And nope, he just Lau, flew away. I... Damn it, Lau. Max. Max? What? Huh? Max Lau? Were you sleeping on duty? Sleep? No, I was trancing. For work, of course. Dr. Lau was submitting her case report. We were so close. Have you found the Aerostaty escape to? No records have been found of such a vehicle. What? Radar and air traffic records show no Aerostat present at that time. What? And no communications traffic has been identified regarding the Aerostat. How mysterious. Maybe he them? Covered his tracks? That would require access to an improbable number of systems, including my own. Such an undetected intrusion into central systems is implausible. Are you saying we're lying? It is possible that you were mistaken. Human error. For the moment, you are advised to pursue other lines of inquiry. If you say so. Something's going on here. All right, let's take a look at our terminal here. That's cute. I'm assuming that's him and his wife. Centralized emergency logistics category for information larceny. Okay, we already have that. Uh, and then perpetrator of the mind jacker. This one is our emails. We have null. Um, it's very important that you download and activate this package in a secure location as soon as possible. Tell no one lives depend on it. Sure. You download data package to your traveler. You're unsure who this might be, an informant perhaps? As much as you dislike the cloak and dagger approach they've requested you, they'll take any help you can get right now. San Diego, Dr. V. Hey, Charlie, why are you hogging Lau so much? The rest of us need a wirehead on cases as well. You can probably guess why you're not letting go of her. But seriously, man, give the rest of us a turn. So Lau is pretty, I guess, is pretty talented with like the tech stuff as well. So we read our emails. Let's close. They've already gotten their preferences set up how you like them. Trying Cables. to tidy Lau's desk for her is a battle lost before it's even fought. And that's what she says. Like it was something from the art of war. <laughs> Waste shoot. Careful, if you put your own arm in there, you'd lose it. 
Oh, that's not a good thing. Data package. All right, so. Locked. Dr. Santiago must be working on something he doesn't want me seeing. Weird. So everyone is shrouded in mystery. Though you can tolerate Dr. Santio Santiago's Santiago's opinions, it looks like Dr. Preston's the only one in the office. You rather avoid another sermon on the merits of centralized government. What's this? Hey, kid. You all right? So there's really nothing here. Okay, let's just go back. So that's that door. Okay, let's try this way. So this is the cell. Oceana something news. Oh, that's the news board. What a beautiful drive. Sure, let's go to the balcony, I guess. The Fel Fulcrum Tower. The pixel art is so beautiful. When people worry, there's always something they find to help them. Drinking, the trance, even God sometimes. Me, I've got a place I like to go to. It's helped me when I've been troubled in the past. He has his own garden. That's so sweet. Better not move it. It's where it's ought to be. Beloved wife. This is Rickshaw Regis. Oh my gosh. It's... Oh, that's so sad. So his wife has passed. Not even knowing, having to glance for a moment, those words are etched in a memory deeper than anything else. Aw, think of us not as engineers, but as artists. So is that why I became a cop? You're not in the mood for gardening. Here goes nothing. Let's open the data Dr. package. Dr. Regis. Yes. So he's a doctor and an officer. Regis? Uh, where's my privacy? Central's still giving us a negative on the aerostat. It's like it just vanished. So I thought I'd better give you a heads up. Do you mind? I was in the middle of something. How did you find me? Central told me you'd be here at Fulcrum Tower. Also, it said, stop turning your traveler off. What a surprise. I like my privacy, though. That's why I come here. You hang around the balconies much? It's a memorial. Take a look at the plaque. Viksha Regis, beloved... Oh, Regis, this is... I'm sorry, Charlie, I didn't know. You wouldn't have. I don't tell anyone about it. Wow. I know you've got some seriously high-up strings you can pull, but I didn't think they'd ever let someone be buried up here. And how the hell can you afford somewhere like this? She's not she buried. She's buried up here. She was processed, like anyone else. I see. The tree's special, though. I made it myself, from scratch. Planted and grew? No, made. It's a cross of Chrysophyllum canato and Prunus serrata. The junk DNA in every cell of it contains her entire genome. Wow. Oh, whoa. Takes a lot of looking after. But you're doing it for her. Makes it all worth it. We were married for four years. I'm sorry it couldn't last. We met in our professions. She was a gen engineer as well. A gen engineer. You didn't have kids? My previous work, well, it left both of us infertile. We had embryos prepared through IVF, but we never got to using them. I'm really sorry. I remember reading it was Baxter, wasn't it? Don't push it, Dr. Lau. Sorry. Oh my god, who's Baxter? You're right, though. This place is very expensive. Why do you think I live in a pod in the southeast barrel? I didn't know that was where you lived, either. I think I figured out why you went off the grid to come up here tonight. You heard about Baxter, didn't you? They let a monster like that walk. They didn't parole him because they approve of what he did. 
He's out because he's got skills Central thought would be useful, with a governor jammed in his limbic system. Well, he won't be the same man. He can't even imagine hurting anyone again. Even if it were completely true, I know that there is absolutely no way I could forgive him. On the bright side, he'd probably be pretty mad at you, too. Well, if he could have thoughts like that anymore without falling over and puking, you put him away, and that counts for something. I know it's not exactly normal for you to open up, but if you want someone to talk to, I... Central wants us? I'm afraid so. We better get going. You coming? Damn it. Get moving, Max. Just a minute, Max. I just Max. need a moment to think, Max. A little privacy? It's why I came up here in the first place. I understand, Charlie. I'll be in the car. I'll see how long I can stall Central. Max. Thanks. I... Yes? Nothing. That's all right, Charlie. I understand. I'll be in the car. I Damn. can't ask for her help in this. I'm not even sure what this is yet. All right. Play the thing. You are alone, as requested. Yes. Now, what is this about? 1448D-A, 1448D-B, 1448D-C, 1448D-E. Excuse me? Okay. Your stomach lurches as you recognize the image. You know them. You've seen them before, but you haven't remembered them by number. Whoever is calling you has four embryo containers your own. What? What about them? They were removed from the El Rassis Medical Center, originally deposited at 1615 on the 11th of November, 2065. They have been fertilized by yourself and Dr. Viksha Regis. They were frozen at the earliest viable phase of growth. Three are female and one is male. They were deposited after your fertility treatment proved- Stop. Why are you telling me this? Who are you? And what are you doing with my kid? My embryos? <gasps> You are about to meet with a contact, Gil Vanderwall. In his home is an active memory module, a most unique model. You will secure it for us. Further instructions will follow. What if I refuse? And what if I don't? That image could be a sim. Apparently, you need more incentive not to waste my time. Ah, oh, shit. I just lost a kid. One is gone. Three remain. Do it quickly. Your legacy is in jeopardy. I don't know, but I feel like this would not be important to me, so I say... A conflict brews in your mind and in your heart. Giving in to blackmail like this would be the antithesis of everything you stand for. Both as an agent of the law and as a human being. On the other hand, you cannot bring yourself to risk a small part of the legacy that you've worked so worked for so many years to maintain. To save the lives of our children? I think I can accept that. Oh my god. I guess if you put it that way, it's literally your children. That's so sad. Dr. Regis. Dr. Lau. This isn't just a social call for an update, is it, Central? Dr. Regis, lately you have spent a great deal of your time off network. It is for your safety and that of the citizens that we... Central? All points bulletin, evacuation in progress at Barber's Gate Transit Station. Case officers Regis and Lau assigned to crisis management. Okay. What's happening at the... All case data has been transferred to Dr. Lau. Your vehicle has been rerouted. Please seek an expedient resolution to the situation. Central out. Business like as ever. Let's go see what this is about. All right. Well, I guess we have another work to do. Barber's Gate Station. All right. So let's Sir, talk to this guy. Over here. I'm Dr. Regis. This is Dr. Lau. We've been assigned as crisis management. Corpsman Durian, Fourth Network. Has it gotten any worse? Not yet, but we've not heard any words since... Hey, I'm the only one here who hasn't got wiring in his head. Central hasn't had the decency to update me. Oh, sorry, Charlie. Well, it's another one, sir. Another what? A, uh, bomber. Another one? Okay, also, I just realized, if Regis is the only one without wiring in his head, it means he can't access the trance. So I'm assuming the wiring in your head is actually, like, you know, your connection you install to connect to the trance, so. What do you mean, another one? This is like the fourth this year I know of. 
Central's been doing its best to keep public awareness down. I guess it doesn't want public panic about it. Or it doesn't want people to think we haven't got it under control. So how do you know about it? I talk to people? I've got a social life, unlike someone. Central marked him when he tripped a chroma sensor. Central locked down the trains and started an evacuation. It looks like he panicked and holed up in one of them. Hostages? Anyone in danger? Any hostages? Central's not mentioned any in the case file. That either means there aren't any... Or it doesn't consider them sufficiently important. Probably wants the transit running again more than it cares about human life. Sounds like he was surprised. Didn't have time to take any. He's not thinking in terms of hostages. He was made as a weapon. Regis? He's a biobomber. The explosives are made of... They are... His bones. That's how he tripped a DNA sensor. Oh. So... What's your take on it, Dr. Lau? Honestly, it's looking pretty lousy for him. Doesn't look like he's got any human shields. I doubt an empty transit station was his intended target, either. Very astute. Charlie, we, uh... You're not gonna like this. Central's just bumped the priority. It wants the suspect neutralized. What? Um... From what I'm getting is that there's a bomber inside this building. We need to neutralize them, not kill them, not let them blow up, neutralize them. So we're going to go in there and figure it out. Neutralized is a vague term. I'm going to try to talk him down. Regis? It sounds like he's hesitating. I may be able to exploit that, but just in case, get to high ground. Fine. You probably know what you're doing. The signal is hope. Don't fire until you hear me say it. Hope. Got it. Keep the public away, and run one more check for bystanders in the station. We can't afford casualties if this goes wrong. Will Central approve of this? We don't have time to wait and find out. Wish me luck. We're going in? Is that him? Hello? Who's there? I just want to talk. I'm unarmed, and I'm opening the doors. Wow, Regis, you're brave. What do you want, heathen? The sight is distressing familiar, distressingly familiar. The brace, the weakened bones, the signs of tampering in a young man that brings back memories long buried. It seems that the best hope can be the leverage. What you know about him, try to find some common ground. You sound American. I'm here to resolve this. You're under... Uh, you sound like you're from America. Am I right? I Texas, I'd guess. Yes. You're right. I thought so. I grew up there myself, near Fort Worth. What part do you hail from? H Houston. I can remember what it's like out there. It's part of why I came here in the first place. I'm Dr. Regis, by the way. Some folk call me Charlie. Charlie Thomas Regis. Beckett. Like the saint. Nice to meet you all, Thomas. So, how do you like the city? It's a wretched den of sin. Like... Sodom or Gomorrah. Well, it's not my favorite, but I wouldn't go that far. I take it you're not here as a tourist. I'm here to do my duty and strike a blow for the Lord. Really? Oh. We're a long way out from the war here. Whole other continent, in fact. I... yes, I know. But now I'm surrounded, and I must make use of what I have. The fire within me. Wow, okay, um, how's the scoliosis? You're not going to last very long. Oh god, I know, I'm just gonna ask how he's doing. I... What? And the osteoporosis, the rickets, and the diabetes. How do you- It's a common side effect of sloppy prenatal genetic engineering. That, and having your body lay explosive nitrates in your bones instead of calcium. It's a test of our faith. Only the truly worthy who can- It shows just how little the gengineers who made you cared about your health. They made you to walk and to carry a bomb in your bones. The fact that you're a living, feeling, thinking human was merely an inconvenience. She's got the high grounds. Lau. Regis, I'm in position. Visibility good, zero crosswind. Standing by. There have been times when I've lost faith, but I can't let this be one of them. Oh, your next move. Don't do anything stupid, Hope. I'm just gonna I keep used to work to with guys like you a whole lifetime ago. The Lord's Warriors? Something like that. Kids who'd been altered. Weaponized youth. Weaponized You've grown up with so many health problems. Groomed since birth for a noble sacrifice. But this, does this seem like the glorious role you were promised? 
It is my duty to God to sacrifice myself. In an empty transit station, thanks to a piece of bad luck? This wasn't where I was supposed to go. But even the original target, it doesn't seem to fit with God's plan. But if I agreed to go with you, I'd have failed in my duty. I'd just be a prisoner in a strange land. For the Lord hears the needy and does not despise his own people who are prisoners. Psalm 69, verse 33. 69. Right. Wherever I am, I'm always in the Lord's sight. There are more ways to do his work than destruction. We can help you find it. We can probably even fix your bones. All right. I shall not resist. Thomas, you've made a wise choice. More importantly, you've made it for yourself. That's so sweet. I'm glad that Corpsman, we were able to help him. The suspect has surrendered. Take him into custody. Carefully. Yes, doctor. Regis, that was amazing. Central's you know. going to be pissed, though. That was a huge risk. Screw Central. Come on. We've got work to do. The corpsman can handle it here. Yeah, with a little help from the bomb squad. <laughs> All right. Fission. Elysium Tower. Penthouse Suites. This looks nice. I love the little Roomba. So, Vanderwall finally agreed to cooperate? Yep. Said he could give us a head start on the Mindjacker. We'd better not keep the man waiting, then. He actually agreed? Wow. Let's go say hi. Vanderwall, you there? You sure he's in? He told us to meet him here. Central hasn't logged any departures from this floor since this morning, either. Well then, um, so he's in there. We haven't got time for this, Gil. I don't think he's answering. Let's keep on trying. Cell agents, open the door. Yeah, he's not answering. We're going to have to try something else. All right, so we love um, looking at the place and hey, seeing how it opens open the door. It's Regis. Nope, that's not going to work. All right, there's a camera there. There's door controls. Cell agents. We're going to have to try something else. Hmm. There's a sculpture. You've never struck me as much of an art lover. I'm not so keen on this kind of thing. The mag coil keeping it floating, however. Ooh, can I take it? Picked up the mag coil. Nice. Docking. Maybe I can grab something from the dock, from the room. What do you dock? make of this, Max? My parents' old bot used to spend much more time in the charger than doing its job. I kept telling them to get a new one, but they never like to spend until they have to. That's fair. Mood. Total mood. What do you? Cool. So maybe let's go here and then. It doesn't need magnetite. It doesn't need mag. What needs magnetizing? Oh, the view. These windows won't open for insurance reasons. Okay. We'll jolt gun. Oh, there Whoa, we go. Oh, <laughs> check out Regis taking the Elliot Ness approach. We don't mm -hmm. have time to hang around outside. I'm just being expedient, as Central puts it. Whatever. Expedient. Vanderwall's not going to be happy about you busting his door. Then he should open. Then he better figure that out. Don't like to be kept waiting. That's suspicious. Gail, you in here? Oh, excuse us, miss. I'm Dr. Regis. This is Dr. Lau. We're cell agents. Is that blood? Miss, are you all right? Regis, this is a synth. <laughs> the look on your face is priceless. A synth? It's a very expensive one, but it's still a synth. And apparently out of charge. Something else about it bothers me more. The blood. The I know. blood bothers me. I hope that isn't blood. I feel like you guys have do been doing this for a long time, so you should probably know if it's blood or not. Uh, refrigerator. Let's take a gander. Is this refrigerator locked? Who the hell locks a refrigerator? Snacks. Maybe they've got really expensive tastes. Oh, God. What can What's you on make? the menu? If you're feeling peckish, 
I could whip up some real nice and white wine sauce. Or oh, how about some nice tortilla rums? Sounds better than what mine can do. Or if you want some of Mr. Gill's favorite, I can always make toaster pastries. Wow, how, how expensive. How much did you set the Walls back then? I'm only 410,000 quanta from all good retailers. That's more than I make in a year. These people can apparently afford the finer things. Okay. Can you make barbecue brisket? Sure can, American style. That'll do. Extra sauce? You bet. Protein complex A or B? Pardon? What protein complex do you want me to make the meat out of? Uh, beef? Oh, I'm sorry. I don't have any real beef. All right, that's Never enough. Mind. Okay, she's still super annoying. Oh, I did not mean to go outside. I meant to just look at the painting, because, you know, art sometimes reveals some useful tools. Okay, let's take a look around the thing. Terminal. This is a drinks machine, a wine rack. Ooh. They've got a refined taste in wines, I imagine. Actually, no. They're all either a couple of years old or fabricated. Weird. Maybe they're doing something to the wine. Like what? Well, say they were also adding amphetamines to it, for example. If they accidentally ruined it, it'd be better if it was a cheaper wine. That's fair. Howdy, partner. What can I get y'all? Um, the Vodka. usual. On the rocks, twist of lime. Regis? Fine. Make it two. <laughs> Make it two. <laughs> uh, so what, what are do you? you do here then? Why? Well, I'm the bartender. The bartender. I fix up drinks for the fine folk who live here. Anything else? Anything else? Heck, drinks is a whole lot of stuff to know. Why, I'm the foremost expert on fine drinking in these here parts. So if anyone wanted to know what to put into a drink, they'd come to me, sure as shooting. Nice. So what's There's happened? There's been a bit of an incident. You don't happen to have seen what went on. Hey, Mister. I don't just go blabbing my customer's secrets like that. He's bluffing. He never saw anything. You're just bitter you never left that wall. Hey, it's a fine job I have here. I ain't seen nothing since Mr. Vanderwall got his wine out of the rack this evening. All right, that's I'll all. I'll speak to you later. I'll keep your tab open. You're hilarious, guy. This game is so cheeky and awesome. So password, we don't actually know the password, so we're not using that. The room. Jesus Christ. Oh. What the hell happened in here? Did someone get to Vanderwall before he could talk? Maybe it's a domestic gone bad? The blackmailer said nothing about this. Possibly didn't even expect this themselves. Oh, gosh. Okay. Um. There's body parts all over the place. Okay. Still, you need to find what they demanded before the whole apartment is picked apart by forensic... Drones. We should check around first. What? We need to get a look at it ourselves before the crime scene people wreck it. Okay. Good idea. <laughs> really? Well, yes. Who are you and what have you done with Charlie Regis? What do you mean? You're unusually cavalier today. You got something on your mind? I mean, I know you don't usually care what Central thinks about regulations, but... It would help us. It's the right this thing to time, do. I think it could help us get a lead on our investigation. Besides... All the time we waste, the Mindjacker may have found their next victim. I like this, Regis. Let's get investigating. You feel glad that Max suggested it and not you. Now you have the free reign you need to find that device the voice wanted. All right, let's take a look. Photo. Picked up the photograph. Let's take a look at the photograph. You can't use it. Okay, okay, fine. I won't, I won't use it. Um, body parts. Picked up a hand. I think I'm carrying as much of Vanderwall around as I want to. <laughs> We're carrying his hand. Can we? <gasps> we can use his fingerprint. I think I'm carrying. That's art. I don't think I can justify taking that. There's something at the bottom of the pool. A pistol? A murder weapon? One of them, maybe. It's too deep to reach. Not without severely contaminating the crime scene, anyway. Okay. I can just about make out a pistol at the bottom. Careful how you get it out, though. You're the one who's always lecturing me about contaminating crime scenes with DNA, after all. Okay, I think... Control pad. 
Let's look, take a look at the control pad. The system's floor trobe. Storage control. Uh, general error, mechanical error. Okay, so, ooh, there's a floor drobe. So there's like, I guess your wardrobe comes up from this f floor. That's so cool. Okay, let's read this. Oh, it worked. Oh, because there's something stuck inside of the hangar. We're stuck inside See anything of it. interesting? There's an empty gun rack in here. Ammunition, maintenance tools, cleaning spray, but no gun. In their closet? Maybe it's their outdoor gear. There's fishing equipment in here as well. Are you taking stuff again? It might be useful. Call it a hunch. A fishing rod. Call it a hunch. All right, that was okay. We got something from it. What was it? It was a fishing rod. Oh my god, let's fish for the pistol. <gasps> no, 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 no. We got to put the magnet on it. Nothing biting. Yeah, cuz I'm an nothing idiot. Nothing on the end of the line. No way I can hook that pistol. Yeah, we need the magnet. There's oh no way god. to hold it on without a hook. <gasps> Hanger. It doesn't need magnet. It doesn't need hook. Now it's got one enormous hook. And now there, a magnet at the end of a fishing line. For catching submarines? It's grabbing that pistol. We are getting there. Got it. We're the on murder the case weapon? and we got One the murder of them, weapon. Anyway. Why is it in the jacuzzi though? What we really need is a witness. I mean the the maid, so let's go and deal with the maid, I guess. Let's go see if we can um, do anything about that. Okay, but to get her charged. Hello? Hmm, I think I know what's wrong with it. Should we play push That's her? That's a very expensive synth they've got for a house girl. Jealous? She's not my type. What do you think they use her for? They may be married, but I wouldn't put it past them using her for other things than cleaning. There's a product marker on its back. SNS Synthetics. They're not showing up on a net search. Maybe Vanderwall has more info on his terminal? Good idea. We can see if we can get their help in extracting more from this machine. See? I'm not just a pretty face. Hey, Max. What's up? Let's just Any talk about the maid. what's wrong with the maid? I couldn't even get a return signal out of it. My guess would be that it's run out of power. Any way we can fix that? It's supposed to charge itself, but apparently it hasn't managed to do that. How? We can't haul that thing to a socket. Hmm. We'll have to charge the power cell itself. In a platform like that, the cell's usually in the upper torso, about where the heart would be. You reckon that'd be easier to charge? It's only about as big as your fist. Just have to get it out of her. Okay, so I have a knife. Keep at it, Max. Can do, Regis. Well, I'm just gonna... What help my to? I'm gonna Just help doing myself some surgery got the power cell okay now let's take the power cell to the charging thing it doesn't take this kind of power cell actually I realized maybe that's not a charging thing I'll have to do the one outside the vacuum cleaners power cell thankfully no, 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 not We're there. leaving already? No, no, no. Not yet. Just no, no, no. checking it's still there then? Um, I just clicked on it by accident. After a few moments of contact, the gauge on the side of the cell fills. Nice. Now let's put it back and go back in. Let's talk to the maid. Hello? Hmm. I think I know what's wrong. Oh, whoops. I should just... Oops. Crap. Don't know how to click. Let's grab the cell and f throw it into her. Oh, she's awake. Hello, Mrs. I like their systems beginning reboot. Beginning recovery from critical failure. Basic input output executing. MBR unified bootloader executing kernel. Kernel executing S-B-I-N-I-N-I-T. Calibrating CI state with USD. Oh, that is better. Oh, I love her accent. Very nice. Bonjour, monsieur. Oh. oh, hello. So, who are you? Who are you? 
Je m'appelle Chantel. I am Monsieur Gale and Monsieur Dakarai's maid. You're a synthetic maid? Pardon, mademoiselle, I, I do not understand. A synth. Excusez-moi, what is a synth? It certainly stays in character. I uh, help the masters with their household things. And where were you made? Mademoiselle, I was born in France. Yeah, because all French people I know run on graphene power cells. You're hilarious, so the crime scene. What the hell happened upstairs? How do you mean, monsieur? The room's recent redecoration. Shades of Giel everywhere. And huh. the body of Dakari Vanderwall, shot to pieces in the tub. Any opinions on this? Oh, monsieur, I cannot discuss this. I have been told, most strictly, not to discuss what goes on upstairs. Even if it includes the double homicide of your owner? I have my orders. What would Monsieur Gale think if I went against him? Probably not a great deal anymore. She doesn't quite seem to get what's happened. Might not have been written with a comprehension of abstracts like death. Yeah, so what do you do? What do you do around here? I do the cleaning, the cooking, and the shopping. And that's it? Monsieur, it would not be proper for me to say. So you are a sex bot. Figured Mon you Dieu, out. How dare you infer such a thing? Um, so yeah. Have you had your safety protocols removed? Monsieur? Would you be able to do anything Mr. Vanderwald told you? Anything? Anything. Monsieur, you should not ask such questions. I am just the maid. That's hilarious. Why the hell did they get a synth like this? Surely you realize, monsieur. All the best maids in the world, they are French. And the best lovers, I hear. What are you implying, mademoiselle? I never had Giel down as quite such a... Francophile. I am also very discreet, monsieur. When you care for someone's home, there are a lot of things that you hear. Or do. Mademoiselle, such slander. And even if true, I, I would not say. I have Monsieur Gilles confidence to think of. Okay. What can you remember? Maybe we can get more sense out of it if we knew who made it. Where did you come from? Lyons, monsieur. No, where did you really come from? As in, who put you together? Monsieur, I do not know what you're trying to imply. Super user platform driver detail int 10216A actual update source. Search. S and S. Synthetics. City of Newton. The name's not appearing on the registration list. Maybe Vanderwall has the contact data? If they can give us an easier way than cracking its skull open. Wow. What can you remember before you ran out of power? Monsieur, I remember many things. My memory is holographic. But I have Monsieur Gale's confidence to consider. Even if Cell requires it? I cannot simply discuss what happens around here without his permission. He certainly paid for loyalty. Yeah, so... Um... What can you tell me about the Vanderwalls? Tell they us more. They are the best employers a young French girl could hope to have. Are they... Um, are they really? Quite so, monsieur. So loving. And with such exquisite taste. Wow. They must have got this one customized for sycophancy. Do you know anyone who might want to hurt them? Oh, no, monsieur. They are beloved by all. All right, so that is all. Thanks. We'll keep looking around. My pleasure to evict, monsieur. Occasionally, glasses the maid to give you impression she's worried and might make a break for it. You're probably just projecting. <laughs> hey, Max. Talk to her. What's up? So, uh, what do you think happened? What do happened? you think happened? From what we've seen so far, the marks on the gun suggest Vanderwall shot his husband. And the walls. And the windows, the bed, the door, the pictures. Maybe a domestic dispute? We don't really know how things were here. He wasted a lot of shots. Do you think he missed all those times? Or he was shooting at something else and happened to hit Dakari. I don't know. Okay, so... The terminal built into the piano must be older than I am. It's a virginal, not a piano. It's more like a harpsichord. Like I said. It's less impressive you know that when you can run a search in your head. I tried using Vanderwall's hand on the biometric security, but it didn't work. Maybe because it's dead? How would an old terminal like that know? How do you check if someone's alive? With the scanner in my traveler. Ugh, if you had to do it by hand. <gasps> a pulse. Keep at it, Max. Can do, Regis. A pulse. Okay, hand. A big old jolt's not gonna make it work. Oh. 
cooking gel heats. Need... Heats. It needs heat. Cooking gel. You cover the hand in thermal gel and it becomes noticeably warmer. It's definitely his hand, but the system won't recognize. What do you mean? Oh, maybe we can ask the maid about the picture. Bonjour, uh, hello. Hello. Thanks. My pleasure to evict, monsieur. I'm gonna ask her about they this. They have always loved Perry. They are planning to return next summer. That makes sense. I think I know the password now. Paris. Boom. Thank you, lady. Like, what's a normal human temperature? I don't know. Is it like room temperature? Like 25 degrees Celsius? I know 100 is a fever. Or like 100 Fahrenheit's a fever. So. You can set the temperature control on the gel. That's cool, actually. That's really neat. That's, and can I do that to the hand now? You cover the hand and it becomes noticeably warmer. But is it warm enough? It's not. Okay, let's try it. A little higher. Cover the hand in thermal gel, becomes warmer. Gil Vanderwall's cold, dead hand. It's still cold, you think? I'm gonna freaking go even. Begins to sizzle and burn. Hmm. Something smells good. Um. It's probably because she's never had anything organic before, but that's gross. <laughs> that's that's gross, Lo. It's definitely his hand. Oh, am I doing this wrong? A human hand covered in thermal gel from the kitchen. It's sizzling and cracking as though from a barbecue. Figuring out the best temperature for this. Maybe 100. Let's try that out. Noticeably warmer. A human hand covered in thermal gel from the kitchen. It's warm enough that it might almost still be alive. Ew. But okay. This freaking works. This better work? And it did. Okay, Amelia. And then this is the contacts. All right. So Al's ba body shop. There's a lot of people. Jazz hands. Jazz hands, jazzercise your way to health. Fun, jazzercise your way to health. Mom? Let's call mom. I think we'd better save that call for after we understand what's going on. That would be on. so awkward if she picks up. Okay, SNS Synthetics. Stepford and Son, Synthetic Associates. Liam oh. Stepford speaking. Ah, oh, Mr. Vanderwall. I trust everything is satisfactory. Mr. Stepford, my name is Dr. Charles Regis. I'm a cell agent. Oh my, yes. How may I help, Dr. Regis? I'm investigating the death of one of your clients, Giel Vanderwall. Oh my, yes. That sounds terrible. Terrible. So, who are you? We've got your company's name linked to the synthetic in the apartment. Oh my, yes. A repurposed IL-240 platform running a BN-110-187 update cycle. A maid, yes. And a very expensive one it was too, yes. That looks like the one. Oh my, yes. He purchased a complete body. Though it looks like he had some afterwork done on it elsewhere, oh yes. What kind of afterwork? It looks like the personality was tooled elsewhere, yes. Oh. Likely to more particular tastes, yes. Not something you'd do? Mr. Regis, this is a family business, oh yes. Oh my gosh, I... We Jeez. simply sell platforms. We cannot be held responsible for alterations thereafter. Okay, that's fair, so it won't cooperate. We brave this synth to be a material witness, or involved, in a murder. Oh my, no! How horrific! It's unwilling to cooperate with us, though. Vanderwall seems to have ordered it to remain silent about certain areas of his home. Oh my, secrecy is one of many reasons that users opt for non-OEM personalities. OEM? If you wish, I could have one of my engineers disassemble its mind state in order to recover memories. This may take several hours, depending upon the algorithm used for laying down synaptic engrams. I'm afraid time is a critical factor, Mr. Stepford. Is there any way I can do it here? Oh, there may be. Oh my, yes. I shall transfer the necessary tool. 
got the splitter app mind state splitter added. Um, so what does What's it do? What's the splitter for? CI platform mines are modular, Dr. Regis. Oh my, yes. All are made of three components, personality, role, and platform memory. The maid's desire not to tell you likely stems from her personality. So if she had a different personality... Something more helpful. She might tell us what we need to know. It may not be quite so simple, but that is the foundation of the idea. Swap it oh, yes. with Sheffy. Where would I find other mind state modules? Any other platform that runs a communicative interface. It is not simply limited to synthetic platforms. Oh my, no. Oh, that is super helpful. Okay, That's let's check with Sheffy. Please don't hesitate to get in contact if you think we can help. Oh my, yes. Thank you. Okay, let's talk to Sheffy. Hi, I'm Sheffy. What can I get for you? Can you, can make... you make beef fajitas? <laughs> beef fajitas. Mm -hmm. Good choice. How would you know? You never have to eat it. I think I need to get me one of this model. All right, that's never enough. Mind. So Bye. what can I do to get her splitter? I'm getting, I'm putting um, splitter into Sheffy. All right, acquired, mind state acquired. Now let's go to the Bonjour, maid. Monsieur. Hello, uh, you have blood all hello. over you. Thanks, we'll keep looking around. My pleasure to evict, monsieur. Yeah, I'm gonna slab this in ya. Right, so we got the maid and the chef. So, so far, your personality needs to be the chef. The memory needs to be the maid because we need access to the maid's memory. And the role of the maid. Personality maid, memory maid, oh, me chef. And the role of the maid. I think that would work because if the role of the maid, that means oh, that she just wants to clean. I thought she just wants to eat, make food. Well, let's do it. Let's try it out. All right, let's talk to her. Hi. Uh, oh no. Hello. So. Who are you? Who are you? Well, when they get messy, right? Right. I clean up the apartment, right? Right. And anything else that needs doing around here. I'm here to make everyone happy, whatever it takes. Jeez, it's like giving amphetamines to a synth. <laughs> no wonder they only keep this personality in food machines. All right, uh, what can, what you, can remember? you remember? before you ran out of power? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yes? I remember something. I, uh... What is it? I'm sorry. The memory module is holographic, but isn't wholly compatible. I need something to help me remember. You're asking for a bribe? <laughs> oh, Regis. I just need one of those nemi, menmi... Mnemonics? Yeah, that's it! So, something that'd help jog your memory about what happened. Yeah, that's it! Maybe we could use something from the scene. Oh. So, have you had your safety removed? Have you had your safety protocols removed? What's a safety protocol? Uh, it stops you hurting people doing things you're not supposed to. Why would I want to do that? That'd be real mean of me. She's yes, so annoying. But sometimes there are accidents. This platform's got nothing nothing like that, but I'm not going to hurt nobody. She's creeping me out. All right, that's Thanks. all. We'll keep looking around. I'm going to show Have her. A really great day. I'm going to show her the hand. He can't use that anymore. Sure. Hey, that's Mr. Gill's hand. Where'd he leave that? All right, uh, maybe to remind you of the photograph. They had a great time back then. That's why they wanted a French maid. Um, how about this gun? Oh. Oh. I remember. There was something about that and Mr. Gill. Go on. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. There was something about his wine. But I'm afraid my thing is food, not drink. I don't know a thing about what they were doing to it. Maybe we should ask someone who knows their booze. The barman. Oh my gosh. Okay. I'm going to grab this memory thing and slap it into the drinks machine. We're figuring things out. This is great. Let's split and grab the barmaid. Oh, crap. 
So let's go ahead and now put it back in her and have a conversation with her. Hey, y'all. Uh, hello. Um, What can yeah. you tell me about the Vanderwalls? They're a strange pair. We can tell that from the decor. They're trying to get away from their connections to organized crime. You've overheard a bit about this. Oh, yeah. They've been trying to go legit for years. But with Gil, it was always just one more job. Oh, so... What, what can do you remember? remember before you ran out of power? Ain't much to remember. Gil chose another one of those terrible wines. Then he got some stuff out of the fridge and went upstairs. Ain't seen him since. Not much to remember when you're built into a wall. Except you're not anymore. Ah, oh, hey, you're right. Ah. Oh. Have you had your safety protocols removed? Nope. So, this platform was restricted in terms of what it can do? Nope. Huh? Never had him in the first place. Must have been a customized personality. Nice, so... What do you do around here? I'm the apartment's drinks machine. I give suggestions on the Vanderwall's choices of spirits and liquor. Dressed like that, I bet the patrons are hitting on you all the time. Hey, it's not my fault men are drawn to my womanly charms. <laughs> oh my god. Who are you? I'm the hired help. You're a synthetic maid? I clean up around here. Them boys are messy. Need a woman's touch around here. Well, this is different. Why the hell did they get a synth like this? Believe it or not, bartenders gotta be pretty smart. Like a chemist mixed with a therapist. Then shaken and stirred. Mm, exactly. I like the way that People sounds. People gotta trust their barman to know what he's talking about. How are they gonna do that if they don't sound the part? Thanks. We'll keep looking around. Y'all come back real soon. My gosh, I think we got hey, most of the information out of her. Doesn't that synth have a holographic memory? Why does it want a mnemonic? I suppose the new personality is having trouble interpreting the maid's way of forming memories. If we could find something related to the incident to jog its memory. It would be like pointing it to the right place on a tape. What's a tape? Ugh, never mind. Just feeling really old. Okay, so... That's all. Keep at it, Max. Can do, Regis. Um, thanks. Uh, let's split you up again, because now... Okay. We got to talk to everyone. Let's talk to personality of the chef, memory of the maid, and role of the barman. And see Hi. if they... Uh, thanks. Have a... I need to show you stuff. The best I thing I can give compatible. is Does this the ring gun. any bells? Oh, yeah! It's what Mr. Gill used when he... When I... Oh. We were all up in the bedroom earlier this evening. You're worrying too much. You promised me that you'd gotten out of it. I have. This was merely a favor for an old friend. And look where it's gotten you. They were arguing about something. It sounded big. Don't you think I know what this could mean? You asked me to talk to that damned cell agent, and I agreed. You see what I do for you? I know. And I knew you'd do the right thing eventually. It's not just because it's the right thing, or because you asked. It's because of what it would mean to the whole city. What? Mr. Gill was grumpy, but not at Mr. Dakari so much. Then he asked for some of his special wine. Chantel, be a dear. Bring me my wine. This was the lousy stuff they've got in the wine rack. Special and wine. order. Yeah, but he puts extra things in his wine as well. <gasps> Gil, what's wrong? I. Uh, it must have been my. What? What is this? That's what happened. That's terrifying. Oh no. What's what? Mr. Gill seemed to be real worried about something. Who are you? Oh no, he removed Gil, the gun. What are you doing with that gun? Stay away. Don't come any closer. No! 
Get off me! Chantel! He sounded like he was in trouble. Get it out of me! He kept telling me there was something in him. I asked what he meant. No. It's inside me. Get in there and get it out! And the maid's personality. She'd have done anything he asked. I didn't find anything, though. So Vanderwall had a hallucinatory freakout. Sounds like it was whatever he was putting in the wine. We'd better find out what it was. Oh, I know! I know everything about drinks! Mr. Gill was buying up cheap wine and using wetware to artificially age it! Wetware? What yeah, the fuck? he kept it in the refrigerator. Ow! Jeez, what is that? Can't you hear it? No, because we don't have wires on our head. What sits in the fridge and is a memory module with a strange configuration. Based on what you were told, you're certain this is what the blackmailer was after. There! The wetware on the middle shelf! It rapidly ages the wine to how it's wanted! Not anymore, it doesn't. It's been reprogrammed. That memory module's broadcasting a signal. The wetware in the refrigerator is interpreting it as an order to reformat itself. So, it stopped being a wine aid and ended up a powerful hallucinogen? Looks that way. You want me to carry it? You look uncomfortable. Yeah, something about it hurts. Maybe that's how the mine hacker operates. Hey! We're heading back to cell. A forensics team will be here in a while. Just don't try to make, cook, or clean anything while we're gone, okay? I got it! Th what if she cleans the whole place up? That would be awkward, just cleans up a, f <laughs> a crime scene. Okay, we're back at the building. Autopsy lab. Oh, T minus two hours. Apparently ah. this is what Central wanted me to see. Why would it do this? I stopped him. Charlie. I promised him I could help, and then they, it did this to him. Maybe it's trying to hammer home the message. After all, Central didn't ask you to talk him out of it. It said neutralize. Why would it be so? Dr. Regis just... Oh, that's the guy that we helped. Soulless. Callous. I promised him! His euthanasia was a necessary measure. 75% of the captured bombers have attempted self-immolation in custody. The risk of repeating such an action was unacceptable. He wouldn't have. Whatever the case may have been, cell command offices are now safe from... Central? A... Mm. Uh oh. General alarm. General alarm. Central functions compromised. Localized E war attacks detected within heuristic barrier systems. Systems entering siege mode. All personnel equipped for abstract dynamic countermeasures. Please report to action stations. Repeat abstract dynamics to action stations. Sounds like I'm needed. Remember, no matter what Central says, you've done a great job today. Thanks. Wow. They freaking took my bomber guy. And, hmm, aw, we gave him so much hope. That's all the time we have for today's episode. Thanks so much for joining me on this episode, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. See you there. Bye.